Uh, this is Pete Coulter. I work for Corridor Contractors. Um, we're starting the demo on the, the building here. We finished our abatement and got the water capped off, the sewer capped off, all the utilities, all the power has been inspected and checked and shut down. So it's a safe environment. We just started started hammering on the wall and the concrete today. So we're trying to get this building down as quick and safely as possible. And then we'll move on to this other little building off to this other side here. So. That's what we're here to do and hopefully it won't take us too long. Good afternoon everybody. I'm Jason Hoy with Longfellow Foundations. We've been contracted by the Bunker Hill Mine to install auger cast piling for support for the new uh, structures and machines for the reopening of the mine. Uh, today we're here doing some test drilling to determine depth to bedrock across the site and installing uh, test pile programs to uh, verify our engineer's design for uh, pile capacity uh, as we move across the site. Josh Spencer again here at the Bunker Hill project. Uh, behind me we finally have received the primary mill from the Golden Sunlight Mine. This is the last piece of equipment that we're bringing over from Montana. Uh, one of the more critical pieces that we need to receive over here for the concentrator build out. Hi, my name is Mike Eisland. I'm the process manager for Bunker Hill. Uh, today, you can see behind us, we've commenced demolition of a couple of administrative buildings that we've had here on site. And that is in order to make room for our tailings filtration plant, which will be located adjacent to our concentrator building. Here at site, we don't have a tailings pond for our, our uh, tailings material, so we have to we have to filter everything and reintegrate it uh, in the underground mine or deposit it in our dry stack uh, tailings facility. 